Good day ladies and gentlemen, this is another tutorial from your boy Migo from Hype Inc. And today we're going to be discussing the top 3 best torrenting software. And let's get into it, let's dive into it then. At third position we have BitTorrent, so you're going to want to start by going to your internet browser. I prefer to use Google Chrome, but you can use anyone like Internet Explorer, Safari, um, Opera Mini, it really depends on you, eh? And from there, you're gonna wanna type in BitTorrent, and you're gonna wanna go to this site. I will leave the link in the description, so fear not. I got you. So you're gonna wanna click on download BitTorrent. And then you can just download the free one. But if you have the cash, you can just remove the ads by paying the yearly fee. But you're just going to click on free download and simply wait for the link to pop up. And you're going to want to click start download. It is a pretty small file, so it should download pretty quickly. From there, you're going to want to go to where your downloads are saved, um, depending on what you use. I use a extra software called Free Download Manager, but it should just pop up under Downloads. So yeah, from here, you just gonna wanna go and open BitTorrent, and you're gonna wanna click Yes. You're just gonna wanna click Next. You're gonna click Next. You're gonna say I agree. Okay, next, and then from this point, you just basically gonna click next, and it should just install within a few minutes, and you should be set to go. You're gonna wanna click finished, and there you go, you said that is your third one, it is per torrent. I will leave a few sites where you can actually get torrents from, some of them include Kickass, um, and a few others. So yeah, that is the third one. It is called BitTorrent. Not one of my personal favorite. I prefer uTorrent or Views or Vuze, as some people would say. So okay, at second position U we have now uTorrent is very similar to BitTorrent. Now U Okay, so you're gonna wanna go to their site, but as I said, I will leave the links in the description. So don't there's no need to stress you want to click on get u turn for windows and you want to click on get u turn for windows so it is free and again you should just wait for it to pop up and you're going to want to click start download but in my case i have already downloaded downloaded it so you're just going to go to your downloads and you're going to want to click on u torrent open then you want to click yes. Just want to wait. You're going to click next. And again, like BitTorrent, it is very similar as I said before. You can just click next. You can click next. And no, I do not want to install Opera Mini. You want to click next. And you want to click next. And yeah, like the previous time, you're just going to install it. Wait for it to load. And then you basically set. And there you go. As you can see, it is very similar to BitTorrent. Um, there are quite a few sites. I'm pretty sure you can even get in-house torrents from BitTorrent. So yeah. So that is the second one. It is called uTorrent. It is a very nice small application that you can use. And it is free after all. So I would suggest that you use it. Just be careful where you get your torrents from because often it can be problematic. But in any case, that's fine. Um, another thing is that all of the torrent software is available across multi platforms like Windows, Mac, Android, and Linux. And I mean, it is pretty cool because it allows you to download games, videos, and so forth. Okay, so lastly, we have. Vuze, and you're gonna wanna click 
download and again you just gonna want to scroll down and you are gonna click free download now this is my personal favorite one out of all of them and then you want to click start <laughs> sorry I am getting a little bit sick but yeah it sh your download should be finished it's a very small one you're gonna click open and then you're just gonna wait for it to install just wait while it is loading okay close and as you can see the software will pop up on your desktop It's just wait for this to take its time like it usually does. Almost done. 95, 97, 98, 100. Okay, now you're just gonna wanna wait for it to download. And the download might take a few minutes. It should take about two to three minutes. Depending on how fast your internet speed is, obviously. So let's just wait for that. 38. Mm -hmm. Almost there. This is the only annoying part about this is that it takes quite a few minutes and it is quite a bit bigger than uTorrent and BitTorrent. But personally, I prefer Jose over the other two. But again, it just depends on your preference. I'm gonna click yes. You are going to want to click I agree. And just wait for it to load. It's almost done. And it should basically just launch as soon as it's done, just like the other. So you can just double click on it. And you see it. That's about it. As you can see, not now. Click, not now. Minimize this. Oh. Ads are always annoying, as you know. But as you can see, it is pretty straightforward. And it is just like the others, um, except here you can even download games and stuff. But you won't go into the gritty, nitty gritty details. That is a video for another day. But stay tuned. Please like and subscribe if this video was helpful to you. Um, stay tuned for the next one. As in the next one, I will probably discuss how to actually go about downloading videos movies and whatever i will leave the links in the description so please subscribe